Hello, passionate Springbok fans. We've got some words of wisdom from the legendary Wales head coach Warren Gatland about our upcoming semi-final clash with England at the Rugby World Cup. Gatland, who knows a thing or two about taking on the Springboks, has a warning for England. He believes that they can beat the box, but they should be wary of the dark arts that South Africa tends to employ. I know what it is like to go head-to-head -head with South Africa's director of rugby, and my advice to Steve Borthwick would be to make sure he gets on the front foot and combat any dark arts, Gatland wrote in his latest column for The Telegraph. To have any chance against the Springboks, you must attempt to not just match them physically, but also be tactically smart and show no sign of mental weakness. So this week will be important for Steve to both send out messages to his players about how he wants them to play, what they are expecting from the Springboks, and what areas they have been working hard on to negate the opposition. I am not questioning whether they were legitimate or not, but there have been people out there speculating about it, and I would certainly be putting it out there and highlighting that it looked unusual and raising questions about the protocol, Gatland wrote. Rassi is so good at making comments, which include both praise and raising a point or message that he wants to get out. During this World Cup, we have already seen him have a pop at France by suggesting their players engage in simulation, South Africa are still constantly pushing the boundaries within the laws of the game, he wrote. We have seen them pick a 7-1 split of forwards and backs on the bench. There is nothing against the laws of the game, even though people might disagree with that. They are always looking for an edge for the best interests of their team. And if it is not, it is not. So, what's your take on Gatlin's insights, Springbok supporters? How do you think we should approach this semi-final, considering the potential dark arts from the opposition? Share your thoughts in the comments. If you're enjoying the updates and analysis, don't forget to hit that like button. And if you haven't already, subscribe to Springbox News for more on our journey in the Rugby World Cup.